from ashes to beauty. Could we ever really know love without knowing loss? Or ever be satisfied in our need without Christ having paid the cost? Ever truly forgive without ourselves needing forgiveness? Or truly live without facing death? Could we experience peace without having experienced turmoil? Or can there be calm without a storm? Would we know what it is to be still if we have not been shaken? Would we be able to give compassion without having felt wrath? Can man bleed without first living in the flesh? Or can man be freed without the fiery trial and test? How can we fully appreciate the beauty without the ashes? Yet our Lord suffers alongside each of us the high price he paid, not just dead and buried, but rose up to carry us through every day. So while there is yet breath in our mouth, life in our bones, may we give him glory all the way home. For every challenge is a stepping stone to lift us up out of the sorrow. Let us be thankful for every moment we borrow. For without the weather that comes and the darkness that surrounds, how would our souls ever seek to be found? Reaching up into his marvelous light, from the wreckage below our souls take flight. Having experienced such joy and pain, sensory delight, returning only with what beauty remains, the flesh gives up the fight. Sweet surrender to the great I am. Give me life exploding with love until I can no longer stand. Vulnerable and weak though I am, you reach for me with a strong hand. As a child, this is how you see me, for this is how I truly am.